Hello everybody. Welcome back to the workshop. Today we're going to be looking at my little bench hook here. Um, this is something I made uh, back when I was about 16 I'd say. I'm not 16 anymore. Uh, I've had this thing practically my whole life and uh, when I made it I didn't quite make it square enough. If I look along there you can see it well maybe you can see it's a bit hard to see in this light um, up there not quite square either but come around the other side this end isn't square no big deal but what happens is when you're trying to use it you know, I have to always allow for the fact that this isn't quite square what a, what a bench hook is for if you haven't seen one before it's more of an old an old time working uh, woodworking tool if I piece it, get my piece of wood on there you can see I've marked a line there I can hold that quite firmly against that it's up against the front of the bench here and I can cut through here and I don't need to clamp this piece of wood any other way I can cut right through to the bottom and uh, it won't move around trouble is if, if this is a bit like that or a bit like that it makes it harder to actually get the pieces of wood you're cutting square I've put up with it um, for quite a while now so I reckon it's time we got in there and uh, squared it up I'm just going to stick it on my milling machine and uh, clean around the edges and face it up Th this piece here is actually the same thickness there as it is there so I'm going to use that as my starting point this bit on the other side isn't even the same thickness if I touch it there and come over here you see not the same size so I'll I'll square it square both sides of this one up and, and trim down the edges and it'll all be nice and square again and I can still say I've had it since I was 16 I know some people don't like uh, machining wood on a metal lathe but I'm not one of those people and it'll come out spot on let's go over to the mill I get right around it potentially I could slide my head back a little bit more here I'm actually against the wall of the shed at the moment so I'm gonna to have to uh, clamp that up a different way Hit you guys. Excuse 
bit more heavy. I should be able to just spin it around, put that edge against the table, and uh, you can see me finger pointing there, yes. Uh, and that way these two will be parallel to each other. And I squared the sides up before. I always like to cut in the uh, opposite direction of the cutter, way the cutter spinning. Not going to matter much for wood, but it certainly matters for, much for metal. got that squared up now nice and straight you can use it either way up that way or that way give it a test there we go Easy peasy. Didn't quite come out square. You can see my line disappeared a little bit there. Come out square on the top. I'm just a bit out of practice. Anyway, guys, that's a bench hook. Now you know. Thanks for watching. If you've watched this far, give us a thumbs up and we'll see you on the next one. Can't really see you.